our food quality sucks. Hi, I'm Julia Lundstrom here, your neuroscience and brain health educator and the CEO of Simple Smart Science. In today's 10 minute memory hack, I'm going to just put it frankly, our food quality sucks. I don't think that's new to really anyone. The quality of our soil just isn't what it used to be. In today's mar modern farming practices, the use of pesticides and herbicides and a lot of other unnecessary chemicals strip the soil of its natural mineral makeup. Do you ever take your vegetables or fruits and run them underwater only to really uncover a, a waxy-like film or Maybe the, the water coming off your produce starts to bubble a little. We can see how these practices affect the outer visible part of our foods, but what about the inside of our foods? You might find this shocking. So a study done on vegetable, uh, vitamin and mineral composition was conducted between 1995 and 1997 by the Cushy Institute and produced extremely shocking results. The study followed the nutrient density of 12 different vegetables and found that within 22 years, calcium levels had dropped by 22%, iron levels dropped by 37%, vitamin A, 21%, and vitamin C levels dropped by 30%. Another study published by the British uh, Food Journal was following 20 vegetables between 1930 and 1980 and found that calcium levels dropped by 19%, iron by 22, and potassium levels dropped by 14%. Maintaining the integrity of our soil is extremely important, not only for the plants, but for our health and our animals' health. If we're making an effort to eat healthy for our longevity and brain health, we wanna at least be able to get the nutrients we hope to be consuming from our foods, but we're not. But there are ways that we can make this happen. Not only is it extremely important for our fruits and vegetables or to get your fruits and vegetables from local organic sources to, you know, in hopes of getting better quality in your soil with more nutrient density, but we need to fill in the gaps of the nutrients we could still potentially be missing. And this is where fulvic acid comes into play. This is an organic natural compound that is found in soil and compost and marine sediments. Essentially what it does is give you a highly concentrated source of the trace minerals that really might not otherwise make it into your diet due to poor soil quality. There are many health benefits to consuming folic acid like improved nutrient absorption, reduced levels of inflammation, which everyone needs, improved immune system functioning, increased neural protection, and improved gut functions. One study done on those with Alzheimer's found that regularly taking B vitamins and shaljeet, which is a common form of fulvic acid over a span of 24 weeks, found that their levels of their brain functioning stabilized compared to those who did not take the supplements. So whenever you're looking for a fulvic acid supplement, just as with everything else, Sourcing and quality is so important. Opt for organic and sustainably sourced options when you're able to. And while we're at it, not only is fulvic acid important for us humans to take, but also our plants love it and benefit from it too. By getting a fulvic acid plant supplement for your garden or soil for your potted plants, you'll be increasing the health and livelihood of your plants and flowers as well so that they can continue to grow and thrive, which is what we all want. So take a quick second to like and subscribe to our channel to get our weekly 10 minute memory hacks. Your memory and your brain health will thank you. Thank you.